Hey folks, how you doing today? Uh, today's video is going to be um, uh, just a quick show of, of uh, a few of the more popular apps that I keep seeing people asking about whether this tablet can run it or not. Um, so I'm just going to take a quick uh, look through uh, Netflix, Instagram, Snapchat, YouTube, and Facebook. These apps are so that um, uh, this this video is so that people can see that the, these apps work on this tablet. Uh, but I have to I have to tell you that that for like Instagram and Snapchat, you will need to uh, first install Google Play uh, to to get these apps because they won't be in the Amazon store. And as for the other apps, um, I would suggest getting them from from the Google App Store as well due to the fact that uh, these seem to be the, the updated versions of the apps. Um, so like Netflix here, we'll open that up and then um, Netflix has come out with this, with this new version of their app that will actually allow you to download a movie so that you can watch it later and you don't need the Wi-Fi system so let's say you want to watch uh, Tucker and Dale versus evil you open that up and then as you can see right there it says download now to watch offline later I can actually push that let it download and then uh, disconnect from the from uh, the Wi-Fi system and I can I can watch it on a, a road trip a plane trip um, or anything else where 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 the Wi-Fi system I can't get I can't get so you can see that uh, Netflix works and what we're gonna do is now go back and let's do Instagram we'll get Instagram open here and uh, as you can see it updated and um, well, that's nice. And you know, it's it's Instagram. It, it I don't have a lot of uh, to show on here, but you can see it works. Okay, so let's go to the next one. We got Snapchat. Okay, and of course, you know, I look like crap. <laughs> and we can see, um, you know, I've got this. Whoops, there we go. And I don't have any new messages on, on here, and no one seems to have posted uh, a story. But you can, you can see that. Uh, it, it does work so we'll go back and then we have the YouTube here and it's loading up internet has been slow all day but uh, so we've got the, so we'll just tap one here we'll get it going this video from CES 2017 is brought to you by dbrand skins for phones laptops etc Visit dbrand.com. I can turn it over to my side here. So over here in the entire restaurant that Lenovo has rented out, checking out their new brand. And then I can now, look through here. This here 
The Lenovo Legion Y720 is hardly the first gaming no we've ever seen from Lenovo. They've had ones in the past. They were usually Y something and Someone internally then I can go, go back why, one, and you can see how the video is still playing, even though I'm decided to go one. look so elsewhere. Legion, and this is one of the first products that will bear the Legion So I can look at other videos to see what I want to watch next while this one is still playing. Kind of like and I can bring it right back up again, too, just by tapping on it. Think pretty sleek. It's got an RGB backlit All keyboard right. that's got four different... And then lastly, we have Facebook. I gotta log back in, but I'm not. I can get in. It's just I don't want to show my <laughs> my password to get back in. So, but but you understand that Facebook actually does work on this. It works fine too. Uh, let's see. I have Facebook Messenger. Let's see if I need to actually log into that. Nope. There it is, right there. So you can see that if you don't want to do Facebook but you just want to send messages really quick, you can you can do that instead. So I have both Facebook and Facebook Messenger. And uh, those are these are usually the the apps that I get asked about the most. Um, so uh, this is just the quick quick yeah look it's here kind of video and you can and you can uh, see that they these work so um, like I said before if uh, the for like Instagram and snapchat you have to have the Google Play for the rest of the apps I would suggest getting the Google Play anyway because Google Google actually updates their apps on a regular basis so they're always the newest version. They're always the latest version. Um, I hate to say anything bad about Amazon, but unfortunately, Amazon seems to 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 be slow in in keeping their apps updated. All right, you guys have a good night. Thank you for watching.